UFOs are turning up everywhere. What the hell is going on? I've got three UFO sightings to show you. You're watching The Roach on Florida TV. It seems almost nearly every day there is some amazing sighting in the sky and it can't be explained. Is it fake? Is it real? Is it someone from some faraway land? Well, let's check out this first one. This was in Santa Monica, California, just the other day. You'll see the guy trying to focus here. Oh, you got it. You got it. That's always the hard thing, trying to focus and, and capture it. I wonder what that light is. Because it's a lightning storm. Who's flying right now in this? This guy does a great job. I would think nobody. Now there is a lightning storm in the area, but this isn't ball lightning. I know what that looks like. What is that? Coming up. It's right over there above Santa Monica, Malibu. Tanga. Not moving. I like how the guy uh, tells some people walking by, hey, there's a UFO coming. I think that's a UFO up there. Oh, yeah? Yeah. All right, let's take another uh, check at this. I just want you to see it again. You can kind of listen. Oh, you got it. You got it. This guy does a really, really good job. It's hard to capture this kind of stuff. What that light is. Because it's a lightning storm. This next UFO sighting takes us to Japan. I think this one's a little bit older. Now the guy that shot this actually saw this UFO or UFOs three different days. And he was riding his bike through a park, grabbed his cell phone or camera or whatever he shot this with. And this is what he saw. You can see way off in the distance, way, way out there. Look real carefully. It looks like a plane moving. So at least it gives you some sort of a perspective of what's uh, going on out there. This is very impressive videography, photography. Hard to tell what it is. Again, this is uh, in Tokyo, Japan. And these things are hard to focus on. Um, you know, you're talking a great distance away. This last one comes from Normandy, France. Take a look. This is just crazy looking in the sense of the shape, its uniqueness, its bright colors. A lot of folks reported seeing this on that night. I do know that. Uh, what they saw, I can't uh, confirm with you. Hard to focus again, hard to get a great perfect shot, but it's definitely something in the sky. Uh, is it military related? I, I, I have no idea. I mean, how could you tell? What exactly this is? I, it's just impossible to uh, say, but very impressive video here. Three incredible videos. I love this kind of stuff. Um, I don't know what it is. Is it the military? Is this um, a prank or pranks? No way of knowing. Or is this you know, someone that has traveled far away to get to our planet, how, how would you know until we get more evidence, we will not have, you know, the sure th proof of what this was. So I love this stuff and I'm going to continue to examine it here on the uh, Roach podcast. Don't forget, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. I do appreciate it. I am the Roach. I'm going to scurry out of here. No more Roach on Florida TV. Here's the scoop. I'm doing this podcast. Why, you ask? Because I live in the craziest state in the union. It's insane around here every day. It's Florida man. Stories you have to see to believe. Florida man. But Florida is also home to some of the most interesting stories and talented people anywhere. So we plug in the mics, we turn on the cameras, and we talk. And here we go. There are no interruptions, and we don't edit anything out. My name is Randy Roush, but for some reason, people can't pronounce Roush. So since I was a little boy, they called me Roach. Hey, Roach. Thus, The Roach Show.
I worked as a TV weatherman for over 20 years. Temperatures tonight just a little bit cooler. I always tried to keep it interesting. It's a great gig. I loved it. Cold I don't pretend I'm the smartest the guy wrong? in the room. In fact, my to guests know more about the subject two. than I do. That's why they're here. So I promise you great guests who have thoughts, opinions, and who are passionate about a variety of topics. I love it. You name it, we'll talk about it. And if my guests say they don't have a ride to the studio, really? Then we'll come to them. Hey, technology is awesome these days. So give it a try. The Roach Show Podcast.